I wanted to take out the billboard. That was not quite how I saw myself doing it. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> this is fine. It's okay. Well, I'm dead. It doesn't seem to be able to get me. Oh, I may have spoken too soon. I might also be stuck. Whoops. You have just been blown into bite-sized chunks by a Sarian spider droid. Oh my, now you know why they wanted to close the hole behind you. You have become the unwilling victim of the dreaded cave squid. Tough luck. You know, I think that might very well be the very first time I have ever... He's got so much reach. Holy crap. <laughs> that was the best. Moira's mo Back. What? <laughs> wow. These guys have been doing strength training with the, uh, compies, I see. Know any good postal jokes? Oh, you bet I do! Why are postal workers such great comedians? They have a special delivery, huh? <laughs> You're down in the grass, huh? Nope. Totally not. Yes, game, I know. Residential, it's fine. It's fine. I'm actually gonna put a little residential in here. People can live in the park, it's not a problem. I've always kind of just thought that maybe it's, um, another term for us travel. Oh my god. Okay. It is another word for fast travel, but with altitude. Got it. single silver coin carefully polish it and place it in your pouch what a way to make a what have we here Orad has transformed you into a new source of recreation you of course don't survive this treatment it's tough to make friends around Oh my god, no! No! Get out of here! See? They're out to get me, I swear. Look at him playing all innocent like I didn't notice. All 
here we go. Gate travel begins. Ah! Oh my god. And now these guys are back. What the hell? There we go. Two for one. Raven haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white, riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, Pelican gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. I believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask. Uh oh. Wow. The distinctive shape tells me this is the rare endangered Malay Island mop handle tree. Several hours later. My God. <laughs> there are many sand pits around Sand Rock which contain a variety of fish. Good job, everyone. That ought to keep the Imperials off our back for a little while longer. The yellow leader, it seems I misjudged you. Can you forgive me? Hey, I just painted this thing. Oh my god, the t Wait, what? Pet? What? Are you- Oh my god. Oxygen. Oh, shoot. Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> First death. You can't stop me. I like this so far. I like the ones that have the big, long ramps like this. Oh, no way. Oh, no. Uh, we're gonna be taking our first look. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm sure this is nothing to be concerned about at all. Cool. My battle droids, they're in some sort of discharge loop. And if I move from this spot, they're threatening to blow up. She knew I wouldn't know how to fix them. If you try to do some repairs, they don't care if you move. It's just me who's stuck. Well, I guess we should help him out. Yes, yes, I knew I liked this fella the minute I saw him. I say leave him. You're pretty heartless for such a pretty lady, you know. 
take it back. Let's congratulate his wife. <laughs> Instead, I'm gonna phrase it as a call to action. No, we're not going there. Oh, I guess we're going there. Cecil has become a paladin. Yes, I am Lokaius, your wolf god, and now you may take my oath. Abandon your humanity, my boy, and be blessed as wolf kind. It feels like coming home. Transformation? Or oaths? Don't be a flapping fool, Timon. Timon kneels, and beneath him a green light pools. Dandelions rise yellow out of the sparse, wind-scraped dirt. They grow old and white, throw their seeds, then wilt to nothing. The god rock he kneels upon hums. It cracks somewhere inside. A geode of understanding split. Good evening, folks, and welcome back to the Library of Lore. Tonight we're going to play something we haven't played in a very long time. We're going to get back into some cyberpunk, and we're going to continue the ongoing quest to test out alerts, because they're all new again. I redid the audio. Uh, I probably have some balancing issues to do, so I still only have one alert for each type, but that's okay. I'll add more variation as we go. And we're going to continue to test my stream deck layout because that's all completely out of whack as well but that's okay i think it's gradually improving i've made a few changes over the last couple of days how are you doing candlejack it's really good to have you here and holy crap you resubbed i didn't get to hear that let me redo this Okay, um, on my end, that sounded nice and loud and distinct. How was it on your end? Were you able to hear that? Was it way too loud? Was it way too soft? I guess you need stuff to compare it to, so let's get into it, shall we? Uh, oh, that's actually wrong. We want this. There we go. Uh, oh, um, camera. There. <laughs> How's it going? Your ears are bleeding. Excellent, Mr. Soggy Roman. That's what I'm after. I want to destroy all of you. I, I mean, um, that's terrible. I'll see if I can fix it. How's everyone doing this evening? Up a bit late, so I have time to hang out. It was really loud. Okay. Uh, in that... Oh, yeah. I, okay, I didn't mean to leave that at 100%. <laughs> I meant to start that at 50%. I guess I forgot to adjust that, sorry. Let's put that down to 60%. And I'll give that another try. How's that? Also, I need to get the TTS signed in. There we go. Hey, Bob, how's it going? Okay, so was that better? Still too loud? Too soft? Uh, let me... Get that plugged in. Very nice, Bob. Very nice. I hope that goes well. Okay. We are going to start a brand new game. We are going to play... Let's see. Enemies will have all the tools at their disposal to take beyond, but primarily only enemies at a higher level will prove a challenge. Combat will be a substantial challenge. The effective use of perks, cyberware, combat gadgets, and consumables will be essential. No. I don't care about that. We're doing normal. We are going to go Street Kid. And we'll go with Guy V. This time. Um. Okay.
That's kind of cool. I think we'll go with that. Well, actually, let's look at a few more. That one's not bad. Kind of freaky. Oh, that's neat. We'll go with those. I have Candlejack, but I was playing on the PlayStation when it launched. Uh, now, I was on the PlayStation 5, which actually did smooth out a lot of the PlayStation launch issues, but it was still a less than optimal experience. Let's put it that way. So I've been looking forward to getting back into it since they came out with all their big patches to fix up the game and whatnot. Okay, that looks good. We'll make match the hair. You can do eyelash color too, that's crazy. I did run it on my new system using Max Graphics. It really balanced out. That's really cool. I've really been looking forward to this. So I'm glad that I found myself in the mood to play the more shootery type stuff again. Because it's been a bit. Okay. That looks good. Cyberware. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Okay, so now we're into stats. We've got seven points available. We've got body, intelligence, reflexes, tech ability, and cool. So we're going to pop that up one. That. And that. I didn't mean to go quite that high. Oh, actually, if that's hacking, I think we'll go to four. And we're gonna, yeah. <laughs> You're too kind, Kendall Jack. You're way too kind.
They say if you want to understand the streets, you gotta live them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small-time pushers, you were raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak serve the strong. The only law in Night City you have yet to break. Okay, I've never done Street Kid before. Last time I streamed the game, we went with Corpo as our background, and I had an off-stream game that I had been playing as well, where I went with the, um, the Nomad background. So Street Kid's gonna be new to me. How's the game volume sounding? Now that you have game volume. A little anesthesia. Oh, motherfucker. Everything chill, mano? Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy? You really think somebody local will try to mug me, Pepe? You never know. Listen, V, I got a problem. Serious this time. Spit it out. Find yourself a hole, it sounds like. You need help? Uh, no, I could count on you. Uh, thank it's you, uh, Cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. And he don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V. And I'll talk to Kirk. I'll talk to Kirk. But then you're gonna owe me one. Okay, welcome to Cyberpunk 2077. First time in Night City? No. Pay close attention to the tutorials to learn more about the basic mechanics of the game. Or, if you're already an experienced edge runner, feel free to disable hints. Go to the database at any time during the game to access tutorials as well as read up on the most important topics of Cyberpunk 2077. And you're saving my life. He's a good boy. Truly. He just lacks direction. The demons okay. walk with him. They tear at his soul. This place looks familiar. Burrito XXL. It's big. I love that. Isn't this the bar where a certain spoilery event happens later in the game? I was at the hospital today. Javi's got some broken ribs, but praise Jesus, the bullet did hit him. What happened? Police manhunt. Hey, Kurt. Want to talk? So we got it coming. V. Been a while. Spin it. What you need? Understand? NCPD. Pepe asked me to talk you up. You don't need. Never. What? You took shot hand over the eyes yourself? Nah, tell him I don't bite. Not yet. Got him a break. How's your problem? Cut him some slack, will you? He'll pay. Just need some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No, you let him off because it's me asking. You know me. I'm a man of the biz. So I need to know what I get out of it. I'll owe you one. Transactions go two ways. I get that. I'll owe you a favor. Tempting. Got a Nova idea already. Mm hmm Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh-huh, and four? 
Number four will belong to my client, just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. I do this and the bit's paid? I do this and Pepe's debt is squared? Of course! I'm a man of my word, you know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. Wow. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, a club where our Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. Soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. Car security, how do I get around it? How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. I have this not either. This works like the key Rayfield Tex used for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. <laughs> Come on, Kirk, even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. We are. Glad to hear it. Always said you were a bright bulb. All Head right. to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. Yeah, Looking it's the nomad that doesn't start anywhere near Good here, Bob. Out you there. start out in the we'll outlands. You do end up here matter. eventually. Or, you know, in this general vicinity of this. But you don't start anywhere even remotely close to here. Fast, motherfucker. Okay. The cybernetic god comes to devour its children. Talk to the people in Santo. Tell them to be ready. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? Oh, I remember this really? guy. Long time. Didn't know you were around. Got back a few weeks ago. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See, you got a good down home welcome. How was it back east? Tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Uh, do Marcus, I have to? let's go. I guess I have to. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard it, Marcus. Your return to NC has been good? Busy already? Getting by. Eh, I pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So, Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Went there without expectations, actually. Well, except that it'd be better than here. It wasn't. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Oh, there's Nega. I love that ad. I love it when you get to be just in the car, getting driven around like this. They really need to add an auto-drive mode. Uh-oh. Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carry? Hey, Cobra. How's it going? Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz, once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen Dundale. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be? Well, Patty... No more fucking word. 
Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you, which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Still? Well, anything else? <laughs> it the seems game like just I'm came out. Close. Well, I guess it's been a couple years. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. So, we're gonna be best friends then. That's my takeaway from this. Real good pals. I'm pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. Still have the gift. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who was that? No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in this place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Okay. I need to pause here for a moment because we've got ads coming up. I'm going to take a real quick break to run some clips. And when I get back, we'll continue. Imagine, if you will, taking a bath in sulfuric acid and using pumice for a washcloth. After that bit of displeasure passes, it gets much worse as the acid slowly eats its way to the last critical organs. Finally, mercifully, death takes you. Uh, um. Oh, shit, shit. Whoops. <laughs> oh no! Whoa. Oh. <laughs> what the hell? Look at that. Holy crap, it looks so nice. Oh, what the hell? Oh, crap. And Stara, what the hell are you doing here? Oh, crap. <laughs> Synthetic stomach, huh? Oh, good. And Stara, you would be the one that does medical stuffs. Uh-oh. Um, Aranlor has failed catastrophically while operating on Anstara. Skill trainer. <laughs> uh, is that a hint? Aranlor. Use skill trainer to learn medical. <laughs> oh boy. Aaron Lor failed in a minor way while operating on Anstara. <laughs> Two synthetic stomachs. You're really determined, aren't you? There we go. You're all fixed up now, Anstara. Mind you, I haven't tried putting two in a single enclosure yet. Forget about it. 
Okay, we are back. All right. Where did I leave the game? There we go. Okay. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Your number could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So go with God. Whoa. Okay. He's not kidding around when he says he's gotta go. When you gotta go, you gotta go. find out shortly. B? Status? On location. About to find... Right. We need settings. Uh... First... Oop. need to turn that off. You guys don't get to hear it if it's on the controller speaker. Oh, uh, yeah, let's disable copyrighted music. We turn on all the subtitles. Well, what the hell is this? No. I did not get a PS5 to turn off the damn ray tracing game. Okay. And your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. Jim, how's it going? It's so good to see you. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for coming in with the raid. What's going on, Jim? I hope you're doing well this evening. What were you up to? Let me get you shout outs. Just one second here. Hey, Mad, welcome on in. There we go. Guys. If you don't know Jim Racer, please make sure you go give him a follow. He's an awesome friend of the channel and great content creator. Um, now, I saw a photo on your social media earlier. You're getting set up to add some new stuff to the stream. What's the status on that? What were you playing this evening? Destiny 2. How is Destiny treating you? Uh, folks, if you've never been here before, my name is Gordon McLeod. I'm a variety streamer here on Twitch. I play a wide variety of mostly single-player story-driven games with excellent character and narrative development, as well as some strategy games, sandboxy games, retro RPGs, classic adventure games, and I throw in the odd real-world actual physical brick Lego building stream as well, just periodically for fun. So if any of that sounds good, please do feel free to uh, hit the follow button, and I have a little bit of a video to welcome you in properly. Hopefully it won't scare too many of you away. Come on in, folks. Let's get the stream started, shall we? Whoa! Oh, crap. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, uh, runaway helicopter. Oh, damn it. Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. Oh, shoot. Aspect ratio. Oh, no, 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 no. No oh, crap. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> okay, that Let's go for it.
A. I have not... I have not looted that, sir. Okay. Um. Weird. Okay. Uh, we're back. Thank you so much, Jim. It's really good to have you here. Okay. So, uh, much better this week than last week. That's always good. So, how how are things going? I know you got a bunch of new equipment for the stream. Have you managed to get that set up yet? Uh, California, I'm going to delay that. I don't want to sit up right now or stand up right now, if that's okay. I will stand up, just not right this moment. Yeah, something I can help you with. Who, what? Who said that? Kirk sent me. Mm-hmm. Camera's blind. You got 20 minutes. Thank you, sir. Do your thing. The street kid, find the Rayfield. Kirk, I see the ride. Your moment to shine, kiddo. Good luck. Take this piece of wonder tech for a world. You're a man of little faith. See? We're rich. Now fire her up and call me when you're underway. I'll tell you where to go. Hmm. Looks like this will be a cool breeze. Oh good, now I'm trapped inside. Get the fuck out. Jackie, what the hell? Get the fuck out. Oh, fuck. You can drive. Now out. What, what are you doing? Chingados? How's it going, California? It's good to see you. Your weapons. Don't move. You're under arrest. Stay where you are. Hands where I can see you. Nice and slow. Oh. Good work, Jackie. Jackie Wells, my old pal from the hood. See you haven't grown an ounce wiser. Hey, Detective Stinks. Been a while, huh? Inspector Stinks. <laughs> Same shit. Speaking of, your mug's familiar Holy too. Holy crap, Jim, that's awesome. Come on, yeah. spit it out. You wait it to me. Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. You know, fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tone. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stintz. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, let's just jerk off till trial. And then what? Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. So, they'll probably be out early. 
Are these the thieves? Fuck Ordinary yeah. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking him now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on the investigation. Suggesting we let him go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. Wow. You heard him. <sighs> Fuck. Oof. Vast majority of March off to put together the new racing rig, get some cameras set up. Yeah, I saw the cameras and basically do an entire overhaul of a bunch of things. That's amazing, Jim. I can't wait to see what you come up with for it. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Nah, Stints wouldn't do us like that. You sure about that? Mm-hmm. He's Hayward born, bred, and grown like us. Hate suits as much as you do. Did what he had to do. That's it. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Nah, come on. Job was toxic from the start. Even Kabuki under the counter magic can't get around an alarm like that. Should have known I'd have the PD on my ass. So, maybe now, as God ordained, Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Got the job to seal those wheels at the Coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe was not big and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types. And I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabron's gotta learn. He don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on. Let's go have some lunch. Just like that? You put a barrel to my skull not so long ago. You help my homies. You're okay in my book. No harm, no foul. I like Jackie. None at all. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. It's a kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay. Food it is. Let's go. Okay. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city oh, yes. of dreams! Ooh, I love this town! I like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her! Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals! But only half these gongs will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one! And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Black Hand, and Waylon Boa Boa! The greater the risk, the bigger the party kids! Or so they say, but you can only be a major league player for so long! The faster you live, the faster you burn out! Know where you'll find most of them? The graveyard! <laughs> matters not where you're from, matters not where you start! What matters here is the walk you walk! In Night City! The City of Dreams! Chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the Pinejos that oh, kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? It's been a while. I probably should do it. Sure. Why the hell not? So, Jim, tell me about your racing setup as you've got it now. 
I've seen it before, but I don't, like, I only saw what was on stream. I don't know all the Let's details. Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. Okay, talk to the drill sergeant. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. The skills you gain here will help you survive, even excel on the battlefield. I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to your advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. Because at Militech... Man, Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, station one, you maggot! Move, move, move! Hope you're ready to bust ass through this fascist playground. Uh -huh. Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. Okay. Oh. Ah, right. All right. Yeah, I didn't think you'd find that too tough. What do you say we crank it up a notch? If you say so. Not bad. But it's more realistic if the target's packing iron. Quit standing around and take cover! Press circle to crouch and hide behind cover. Cover can protect you from enemy fire. Is open your target being dead? You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, look. Enemies. Brought some chooms with him this time. You know what to do, V. Ugh. Why I don't like machine guns, I like sniper rifles. platform and we'll move on melee berserker playthrough very nice i might do a little more melee than i'm used to in this one but i'm not sure yet hacking's the next item on the menu might notice i tweaked the course material a bit all right L1 to activate scanner. 
Scan results, robot, Arasaka. Server, explosive. Surveillance camera. Job-related items are highlighted gold. Scan two such objects. Hazards are highlighted in red. Hackable objects are highlighted in green. Objects useful in other ways are highlighted in blue. This training module will teach you how to apply technological tools to combat situations. Jesus, Corpo Speak can even make hacking sound boring. Go full ghost, never get seen, not really once. Not even once. Well, we doing the work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Insufficient RAM available. We'll have to go distract enemies. Corpo trash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. He's easily distracted. All right, all yours. Take him out. Never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork. Especially the dead kind. Now pick up the body and hide it somewhere. All right. You can hide dead and unconscious enemies in certain places. Doing so will help you avoid detection by other enemies. Time for a nap, buddy. Okay. Now, try to take him down in one slick move. Come on, you got this. Wait, what? Okay. Now, try to take him down in one slick move. too far away from it, I think. Think you're ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Why not? Have fun! Camera control. More advanced quick hacks allow you to use the environment of enemies to your advantage. While in control of a camera or turret, you can still quick hack other devices and enemies. Man, I'd forgotten a lot of the fun stuff about this. You don't have enough available RAM units to use the detonate grenade quick hack. Breach protocol can be used to trigger network wide effects. Use it now to reduce the RAM hack, RAM cost of all quick hacks. Oh, this. Uh, okay, so we need 55, 55, BD, 55. To upload the Ice Pick Daemon, you must recreate its code sequence, selecting characters in the code matrix. The characters you select will be available in the buffer. Okay, so we want this. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Now, detonate the grenade. Two minute warning for my next break. And California, I will do the raise the desk that you redeemed once I get back from that break. Uh, hold L1. Aim it at one of the guards. Boom. Okay, that's fun. See? Just needed to shut your brain down and follow orders. In true Militech fashion. Under my wise command, 
You're a real champ. Take your spot on the podium. To access quick hacks outside of this training, you must have a cyber deck with quick hacks installed on it. Not too shabby. Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Before you finish up, dealt out now. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. What's this? Oh, stealth. We should do stealth. Well, we... Right. So first, let's shape up those stealth skills. Actually, before we shape up those stealth skills, it is about time for that break right now. So if you guys will bear with me, I will be back in a few minutes, and then we will carry on with our finishing up just the stealth module. I'm not going to do anything beyond stealth. Uh, it'll come back to me. And then uh, we'll get on with this next part of the game. So I'll meet you back here in just a few minutes. My breaks are usually about three and a half to five or thereabouts. <laughs> They've lost my trail because I am so incredibly inconspicuous. Holy crap. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Stop heavy. They both died. <laughs> oh. What? Damn it. I not fly it? Welcome aboard, yada, 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 yada. Look, you may be our captain, but I don't have to like it. What? What? Welcome to our new captain. They boot their way onto our ship and into our hearts. <laughs> what? This is not at all what I was expecting. <laughs> what the? This is a whole new area to explore. They're all different. Oh, I love it so much. Nope. Show up again. Let me guess what that's going to be. Oh, hey, I was wrong. The 
Okay, he was definitely no behemoth. Okay, I'm back. And the desk is raised. Thank you very much, California. I don't know how long I'll stay standing up, though. It's getting, like, we're getting a major polar vortex effect here. It's pretty cold. But I'll try to go at least half an hour if I can pull it off. Okay, stealth, huh? Tag all of the guards. R3. Enemies that are unaware of your presence will continue their routines. Pay attention to their behavior patterns and use what you learn to sneak around them. Apparently I can't do hacking. I guess I have to rely on stealth for this. When you enter an enemy's line of sight, their alert indicator will begin to fill. Find cover to avoid detection. Find cover, quick. <laughs> nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Okay, so I have to go that away. See, it says they're just going to continue their routines, but they don't seem to have a routine so much as they're just kind of sticking there. Almost, almost. Again, from the top. Okay, so I shouldn't have stopped to get rid of him. I should have just kind of gone. That's fine. Find cover, quick. <laughs> nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. So how many of you guys have actually played this game before? And how many of you played it, like, right around launch before the massive 1.5 update and all? 
Stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Just like that. Just waiting for this guy to make his move, come on. There you go. Come on, sir. Don't make me have to take you out. Sir. Nova, well done. On to the next area. Oh, I actually have to go to the next area. I thought they were just gonna sort of cyber beam me over there. Security systems. Keep an eye out for security systems such as turrets and surveillance cameras which can trigger alarms to alert enemies to your position. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Okay, vulnerabilities take over. Actions, technical, ability 5. To tag a target with your optical cyberware. Right, R3, there we go. Hostile cameras that can detect you have orange scanning beams, while friendly ones have green beams. Cameras will detect you if you enter their field of vision, but they do not register noise. Back to your training, recruit. Reach the exit without being detected by the camera. Nice work today. Just stand on the platform to exit the sim. All right, some advanced combat techniques for dessert. Then we wrap this party up. No, I think we're wrapping up now. That was good. I'm eager to get back to playing. So? Not bad, huh? Now we can get down to biz. Fixer give you any tips? Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Yeah. Let's do this. Greeny! There hasn't been oh, a whole yeah. lot of shooty-shooty yet so far. We're still in the beginnings. I'm uh, starting a new playthrough. How are you doing tonight? It's good to see you. We're about to get to our first bit of shooty shooty. Although, actually, now that I think about it, this particular mission's not going to involve much of that either. But that's okay. Apartments. Job updated. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected oh, abduction. nice. Back to the Baldur's Gate, then? Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Bug, you could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? Call the damn helpline. <laughs> So how's, uh, how's Baldur's Gate going? What were the Red Wizards up to? I would ask why they deserve death, but they're Red Wizards. 
Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomoth. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Probably. Quest line, bunch of tough mage fights. Off to find a dragon to slay now. Sounds awesome, Greeny. Have a good one. I will see you soon. Tapping L1 highlights loot. Make moves, bundle. V. Hold your horses. Jackie, you've worked with me before. You know loot has to come before everything else. You'll be fine, don't worry. Big move, oh no. <sighs> Are we fucking late? Is that her? Is that our target, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo Immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix-ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep a looking.
Where's the other guy? Oh, did Jackie get him? Nice work, Jackie. Looks like you got him. You're clear to go. Ooh. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around. Gotta be there somewhere. Not really my kind of gun, but... Ooh. What the... No, that wasn't what I wanted. Where's my inventory? That is a huge freaking gun. I don't really want that one. Let's go back to that one. How do I just do that one? Got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, Jack and Troy Biomon. Need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. This does not look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is pubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck! He's flatlining! B, need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo! Fuck, this is bad! Hey, catch, Vato! <sighs> I think. Holy shit, it worked. Where, Cabron? Get her outside! Scav rats abandoning ship. Must have seen trauma. Decided to cut their losses. Landing. Stand clear. Initiating security protocol. Follow all instructions. Stop it. 
in the doorway. Place the patient on the ground. Uh, ow. Five steps back, now. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-570442 secured. Stimulus being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for brinogen. No worries. No worries, Sketchy. The game is fine. Besides, my channel is always marked as mature. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my still wires got now. See you in the near future. I got this thing. Anything else need looting? How are you doing, Sketchy? It's good to see you tonight. I'll leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. Damn it. Okay. Can I open it? No? V, thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. Ah, I keep wasting my healing. She's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Okay. Words out the NCPD is going to put Watson on lockdown. If I'm going to sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. All right, then. Two minute warning, by the way, guys. Two minutes until next ad break. Ride back with Jackie. like any other, just bigger. Nah, mano, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Whelan, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. Well, thank you, Sketchy. So how's your week been? How's everybody's week been for that matter? I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh, shit. Right. 
Is it just me or... Oh, I fucking knew it. Fucking drive, Jackie. Come on, Finn. Can't keep her steady. Outside me. Holy fuck! Mierda, perdón. Got you, asshole. V, aim for the driver. Gotcha. <sighs> Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, P. It's okay. It can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Is there a way to hide crowd control deal on the left of screen? Uh, I don't know, actually. I don't see it. I'd be surprised if there isn't a way to hide it, though. Maybe somebody in chat knows. Damn. They're pulling out all the stops. Oh, thank you, Cobra. Oh. Okay, that looks like it's about time for the ads. So I will be back as soon as the ads are done. And I'm going to lower the desk again. So I'll meet you guys back here in probably a couple of minutes. Still weirded out that the librarian is now a woman. Oh, whoa. Temple Guardian. Calcium cost. Yeah. Oh. Thanks, guys. Astrologists report that a devastating meteor will strike the city in the near future. Really? Residents should seek shelter immediately if any is available. A meteor strike has occurred. Yes, don't Avoid say. the impact site and head to shelter if any is available. Okay. Oh, maybe I spoke too soon. <laughs> You're kidding me. They stuck around? Who? Oh my god, the entire frickin' swarm stuck around and camped. Literally camped inside the train. Oh god. Uh... in my house That's my house Oh shoot I forgot that melons are not a summer cr or not a spring crop means I can't get any more unless I can recover some. Let's see. All right, I'm back. The nerd is necessary security measure. Thank you, Officer, sir. ma'am. Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? Uh, heart you, of Bowser. gold. Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm going to be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. I'm waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through, but they're the last. They're so kind. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. 
Pro tip for Stardew Valley, yes. So you can be nice when you feel like it. When am I not nice? <laughs> always? I'm always never not nice. Wow. Jackie's pretty awesome. Yeah, but the goal is not to be absolute maximum efficiency, most profitable of all time. The goal is to have fun. Like your average bust. Cause they ain't your average badges. That's Max Tech. NCPD's Apex Predators. MTAC rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gonks out there though. Just a midday snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. If you're riding as a passenger and nothing important is going on, no. I want more auto drive in this game, not less. I love just being able to sit back and admire everything going on, especially when it rains. Made it. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? Don't let me through. Sure about that? Oh, yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Then. Okay. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. I do it. Jump from T Bug. The task T Bug has given you is an important step on the path to I don't get to know because it disappeared too fast. No, it's weird. It's a different elevator than I'm used to. Go home, go to bed. Wait, what's in here? V's apartment. Sniper rifle, nice. Does that mean I have a sniper rifle? What do we got? You can have up to six outfits saved in your wardrobe. These can be activated and deactivated in the outfit section of your inventory at any time. Activating a wardrobe outfit will change the appearance of the clothing you have equipped, but will not change its stats. That's amazing. That's They didn't have that when I last played it. All clothing you find, receive, craft, disassemble, buy, or sell will be saved in your wardrobe's memory. I love that. Okay, available clothing. Oops, let's see. Punk Aramid vest. vest. Only a gonk would brave the NC streets without one. Practical plaid shirt with micro mesh. Of course it's flannel. Wolf school jacket. Because the world in 2077 could still use a monster hunter. Oh, right. I think that's Witcher themed, if I'm not mistaken. V's streetwear pants, classic immunocotton corporate pants, 
Loose fits with micro mesh underlayer. V's pants. Vintage extra leather straight cuts. Let's see. They didn't bring you much luck in Atlanta. Real leather? Maybe, maybe not. New life, new pants. Lower class chic. Imitation leather with a simple geometric pattern. These street kicks. You've worn these while exploring every shady back alley in Night City. These sneakers. You've walked miles in these, and it smells like it. Can I not rotate myself around here for the whole grand view? No? Okay. Nope. Reinforced baseball cap, begging to get stained. No items. Old camo shoulder straps. This may have seen real time in a war. Second conflict biker jacket. Don't wear this if you haven't listened to the album at least 50 times. Old N54 athletic shorts. Leather ankle boots with composite inserts. Don't need to look good alone. It's what you pair them with that matters. Okay. Sit down. New release brain dances. What's up, BD maniacs? Hungry for a new emo rush? Then check out the latest word from the precious BDs on the market. Okay. Fancy. We will sleep shortly. Body needs some tweaks? Approach the mirror in your apartment or safe house and select the change appearance option. Got some favorite threads? Create outfits in your apartment's wardrobe so you can change the appearance of your equipped clothing whenever you want. Spunky monkey. Check your weapon stash. See, that's what I was going for, but I didn't see how. Oh, that's how. Oh, we have the black unicorn. The razor-like blade is as merciless as death itself. The guard is fashioned from premium materials and the handle is crafted so exquisitely it belongs in a museum. Oh, you know what that means. That belongs in a museum. Most importantly, it remains light and nimble to wield because it was forged DRM free. Wow. Okay, let's see. Should have more wardrobe options now. But not there, apparently. Do I... Wow, I don't have new options? Okay, fair. Whatever. I 
guess we go to sleep. something when I jagged into that corpo's biomon. Don't know neurovirus or I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you to ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. I have to get dressed for this? You're kidding me. I don't know if it's worth it, man. So what? You Hey V. Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Okay. Information broker, then. Piece of shit! Come on! Oh, no, no, no. No, what the worst thing is about this place? Hey, v, Regina Jones here. I heard you're looking for work in Watson. Just so happens I'm one of its main employers. If you don't want to waste those talents of yours, check the gigs I sent you. Do good work, and there's more where that came from. I'll be in touch. some fun and make a little eddies in a single stroke. Fighting tournaments coming up. I think you've got what it takes. Flicking you the cords of your opponents. Money and fame are waiting. Alright, a couple of words about who you're going up against. I'm not going up against anyone, dude. One, Kabuki. Won't spoil this. Just come and see. Two, Arroyo. Buck, 60. Street Ganger, Real POS. Three, Glenn. Cesar. Fists like fucking hammers. Four, Animals Club. Rhino, woman's a legend, plays everyone flat. Oh, and one more thing, until the lockdown on Watson is lifted, you won't fight in any other districts. But don't worry, when things loosen up, you'll be the first to know. I'll be waiting with bated breath, sir. NCPD scanner hustles. The NCPD will help you to f help fight crime. Gigs. Fixers will contact you when you approach a gig's location. Fixers. These intermediaries will inform you about local gigs available. The Ripper mm. Dog. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite, just waiting. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right, or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. You know, it just me. so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. CD, how's it Only going? the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. Dex ain't out of the picture? 
Thought Dex bounced out of the ring a few years ago. Messed with the nasty crew in Pacifica. Things got ugly. Mm hmm It's good to see you, Sandy. Hey, how's it going two tonight? years back. Somehow Dex got caught up in the craziness. There's a lot of bodies lying in the streets by the time the shooting stopped. Yeah, Dex got lucky, though. Managed to slip under the radar till tempers cooled. Took a while, but he's made one hell of a comeback. This is it, Jackie. Our big break. This is it, Jackie. Our break. Dex needs friends, needs us. We can use them. Amen, I say. It's a win-win. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell Ooh, you everything nice himself. CD. Face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal oh, is riding on you now, I see. Wait, why me? Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you. Talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. So is that one got no choice down, then. or is it both down and up? Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a big of his own. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, V. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Vehicles calling. You can call your active vehicle to your current location. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Okay, let's go. Let's feel this factory new ride. That will be ours, I believe. One First gig stop. down. I wish it was down and up, but Ripper it's not go both ways here. I mean, one gig down Easy and 50 gas, up. Huh? 50 is still more ate. than good enough for streaming. You'll be pretty happy with it. I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. I got a date. Me and Misty. You don't say. She's oh. so sweet. Really gets me, you know? The haptic feedback stuff is neat. I keep forgetting that last time I played this, even though I was playing on the PS5, it was the PS4 version. So the PS5 stuff is new to me. Sorry. That'll buff out. It's not a problem. Hey, Hammer. Find me once Dex done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. Okay, so hidden valuables and containers around the city. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. You got it, sir. You look clean. Because I am. <laughs> Man, it took me forever originally to realize that this was actually an outdoor alley and not just a part of the basement or something. Though a common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure which can only perform, be performed by qualified specialists, Ripper Dogs. There are several Ripper Dogs operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyberware upgrades. Select your desired cybernetic upgrade from the list and enjoy your new abilities. 
Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. To what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Whoops. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Any tech that could perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Okay. How are things, Hammer? It's good to see you. Karoshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. Karoshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy, then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. All right, then. Cybernetic implants are mechanical replacements for the organic parts of your body. They can give you superhuman-like abilities which can improve your combat capability and help you survive in hazardous conditions. Although a common practice in 2077, the installation of cyberware is still an invasive and sometimes dangerous medical procedure. Only specialists known as Ripper Docs are trusted to install cyberware safely. Okay, so... We want the optical system. We're going to go Karoshi. Cyberware you acquire in the world can be installed or sold, etc., etc. Okay. Circulatory system. Can't do that. That's too much. Nervous system. Too much. Too much. Operating system. Ah, even if I had the money, I would need more street cred for those. Skeleton, too much. Hands. Ballistic processor, coprocessor. Increases the chance to ricochet shots with power weapons. Directly links the user's optical implant to the weapon system, offering real-time data tracking. Yeah, I needed to get back into it, CD. I haven't played it since it was relatively new, like shortly after release, and I was playing on the PS4, which was the hardest hit system. So now that I've got the massively patched and updated PS5 version, it's time. Mark 1, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. 
display that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. Okay, we will get back to this carving and reinstalling in just a moment because it looks like we've got about a minute till the ads begin. So I'm going to take another quick break and maybe grab a little something to munch on. So if you guys need to get up and grab some food or a snack yourself, maybe a drink, whatever you need to do, now's a really good time to do it, and I'll meet you back here in a few. Um... was not the best play. Oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Um. Down you go. At least I got meat. <laughs> Sorry, Edgar. <laughs> How? How did you not see me? I forgot the grease is flammable. I hope you're not planning on picking my pocket. Uh... That was weird. Joke, brace yourselves. How did the police end up catching the man who was on the run in the bathroom? He stood on a set of scales and gave himself away. Hey, Gucci's. Oh, oh no! It's fine. 
was very discreet. Master of Stealth. Right. Now just a bit more. Mm. Okay. I am back. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town, but been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky gannic hand. Could slip. Wow. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. I haven't played it either since all the Xbox you One series You might feel Xbox a little upgrades. discomfort very nice first. CD. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. So far it does seem a lot better than it was before. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. Oh, beautiful. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can provide you with a lot of useful information, such as how strong an enemy might be, who's in their crew, or what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a list of quick hacks which you can use against your enemies. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. Okay. I also injected an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Ooh, nice. A database with individuals with bounties assigned to them is now available to use. You can identify these wanted persons with your scanner. Since all are wanted, dead or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. I can download a 100 gig game in around a half an hour right now. What is my ISP gonna do? Challenge me to blink before it's done? Gonna keep me waiting all day? Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stim. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. All right. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Never could. Jackie, we're ready. It's a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. All right. V, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. 
the number of cyber psycho attacks in this city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate for a max tag fits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Incapacitating enemies. There are various ways to incapacitate enemies without killing them. Non-lethal takedowns, non-lethal quick hacks, non-lethal weapons, EMP grenades, and some combat gadgets, and weapon mods that change damage to non-lethal. If a given weapon, combat gadget, or quick hack deals non-lethal damage, it will be mentioned in the description. <laughs> GoldenEye on Xbox has been loads of fun also lately, I forgot how great the GoldenEye soundtrack is. I've only seen a little bit of GoldenEye played, I've never played it myself, either the original or the new version or anything, but I've heard nothing but really good things about it. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. I need that whole process. What do you think? Not at all. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Need to act to resolve in that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving the Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a military convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Sounds doable. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat-out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shit from one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? 
corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay, sounds fair. For me personally, it's the grandfather of first-person shooters. Mm, okay, for you personally, I, I'll give you that. I'm not kidding when I say hearing the GoldenEye music hit when it was first announced literally made me cry. Your childhood is alive and well again. That's awesome. That is awesome. There have been a few retro games I've played that have hit me kind of like that. It's really cool when you get to go back and re-experience some of that old stuff that you love so much, especially if it holds up. All right. One more thing, Mr. V. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? You got it, sir. Great Later thing. now. Oop. All right, let's get out of here. Great thing is because the controls were redone on Xbox, it means being able to fully use all of the power of my Elite 2 controller, the hair triggers, and the back paddles in this 26-year-old classic. Very nice. Hey, Patriotic, how's it going? It's good to see you. Hope you've had a good week so far. Hope everyone has, for that matter. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah. Clint to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. Right, right. Heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Huh. Hang on. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. I must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. But I live. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Stick around. It's not a way to. Okay. Not bad. Hopefully, same for you. No, pretty good. I've kind of been missing this game. This is a really fun game, and it looks like the updates have really improved things a lot. Hey V, thought just occurred to me. Can't start your career in the major leagues right by start boarding some rag of a t-shirt. The wind blows a, long strong, a lot stronger up there on the top of the world. Old timers like me hate to watch you kids catch cold. Left you a couple of things in your stash at your apartment. Give them an honest try and I'll bet they'll fit you just right. Another? Hope you didn't 
You don't think those Kiroshis were charity? Anyway, where else would I find a home for these things? Not Misty's style and my punk days are long behind me. Anyway, hope they serve you well. As they say, style is supreme. Or maybe they don't anymore. I don't know. Okay, let's head back home. Where do we live? Oh, I have to level up. Two attribute points and two perk points. There was a bunch of bad reviews when this game first out. I heard the updates really helped it. Yeah, I don't pay attention to reviews. People don't know how to review stuff. They hear stuff and they react to that instead of what the game's actually like. I had a lot of fun when it first came out. It was good. I mean, it obviously, it had issues, of course. But it was good. Ninjutsu level 2, Cold Blood level 1. Crafting, engineering. Where the heck is sniping? Movement speed while sneaking. Yeah, so far I'm enjoying it. I mean, we're still just kind of getting into the basics of it, really. But Still, where are my attribute points? Oh, okay, hang on. Um... Seven, cool. Yeah, I wanted the map. Where is... Oh. Oh, that is the map. I can see, I swear. The gun, collect your gun from Wilson. Actually, that's pretty much how I'm so let's do that. Yeah, no, I had a really good time with this game when it first came out. Most of the problem that really kept me from enjoying it as much as I could have, it wasn't so much the performance stuff as it was the fact that the game had the habit of occasionally crashing on me just outright. 
then I would have to restart. But the PS5 was fast enough that, you know, that even that wasn't the biggest problem ever. As long as I didn't lose too, too much progress, then it was okay. All right, let's see what you got. What I like to hear. All right, let's see. Dying Night. That's not good. Sell Junkin' Jewelry. Three Junkin' Jewelry for nine bucks. We'll do that. I forgot we have to do the no shooting way. challenge thing to get the gun from him. Oh, fine, Wilson, what's going on? We'll do the silly challenge thing. Let me just save the game first. So what exactly am I doing? Legendary Unity Pistol. How much cash do I have? Not enough. So, what is it wanting me to do here? Upgrading iconic weapons and clothing. You've just received an iconic item along with a set of iconic crafting specs. Ah, that's why. You can use these to upgrade it to higher rarity, substantially increasing its power. Iconic weapons and clothing can be found all over Night City and are uniquely capable of increasing their rarity with the right components and crafting perks. When a higher rarity iconic item is crafted, the lower rarity version is destroyed. That's okay. There we go. Now, Vic left us some stuff back at home, too, so let's go there. Excuse me, come through. Pardon me. Take that. Okay, so we still got that. I thought he left me stuff. What the heck? Do I have to pick it up again? Talking like it was armor. There it is. Okay. Oh, here. Luminescent punk jacket. More zippers and buckles means more dangerous, like bright colors on a poison dart frog. Multi-layered sin leather delta jock jacket. With an empty clothing mod slot, the item will be upgraded to epic after 5 and to legendary after 12 upgrades.
Okay, hang on here. We want... Double barrel shotgun. Power assault rifle. Power pistol. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to go with the shotgun. It's kind of unfortunate. Our upper body, where's our fanciest stuff? 13.8, 13.8. Vintage extra leather straight cuts. Real leather? Maybe. Maybe not. 5.9, 4.1. We're going to go with these. Okay, that ought to work. are in progress. I apologize, guys. I'll be back in a minute. Now I'm terrified because I've got so many companions, it's inevitable that one of them is going to set some of these off and I'm just going to get whacked. Like that, for example. Guess this way it is. Now, where's this other guy? Oh my god! That has to be a reference. That must be a reference. There's no way that's not a reference. Strog jog rog? Um. How did I. Oh. Oh my god. Oh shh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god, these things are so terrifying. And now I'm locked into a Okay, I'm back. Okay. Easy access to protective firearms. Schools and hospitals have been closed until further notice. What's next for Pacifica? No.
Binkenstein, thank you so much for the follow. How are you doing this evening? It's good to see you. What's going on? I hope you've had a fantastic day and a good week. I haven't uh, I haven't streamed in a couple of days. I usually take Tuesday and Wednesday off. So it's great to have you here. Okay, I don't normally take that elevator. I kind of never really been fully aware that that was an option even. Now I have to find my way back to where I want to be. Recovering from a migraine. Oh crap, I am very sorry. Farming silver on Ultra's Valheim server. Oh, that part sounds fun. Man, I haven't played Valheim since... God, what was it? Early 2021 when that first came out? I played it for a good month solid, and then I didn't really just touch it again. I need to, because I've done a lot of upgrading to my system since then. It's gonna be a lot better. I, I was starting to reach the point where on my particular uh, world that we were playing in, I was building this really big construction and it was getting so complicated that my old system just really was not dealing with it well, but I've got a lot more RAM now than I had in that in the computer back then and a much faster processor than I had. And so I have to imagine that's gonna make a big difference. So one of these days I gotta get back into playing a little bit of Valheim. So, how is the uh, silver mining going on Ultra's game? Don't mind if I do. I'll take that. I think they may have made some improvements there too. Yeah, hopefully. I really should load it up sometime and just see. I even have a clip that demonstrates just how stuttery the game was getting when I was in the vicinity of that castle that I was building. Like, I really love the castle. It's a really nice construction that I was doing, but it was not doing my computer at the time any favors. Oh, go to Lizzie's bar. Okay, so I probably wanted to take my car. I guess it probably doesn't really matter. Between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. And it's now 3.42. I'll... Right now. That's fine. I need to go collect my car anyway. Excuse me. Give it through. Don't mind me. What? I can't oh. wait till... Ow. <laughs> I can't wait till I can get the best car in the game again. Where did I park? I have no idea since I didn't come out the same way that I went in. Oh, or I could just call my car and have it come to me. out and built a staircase up a mountain to get to Mordor. Not as flashy as summoning your car in Arkham Knight. I haven't played Arkham Knight, actually. I played through in the very, very, very early days of my stream. I went through Arkham Asylum. And then I started playing Arkham City. But I got frustrated, stopped, and never really went back. But it's, it's one of those series that I think maybe I need to revisit one of these days. I think that would be a lot of fun. Okay, nothing out there, J. 
just yet. Fine. Aren't there four? Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. Aren't there four of them? Origins in Gotham Knights seem a bit less quality. That's... I haven't heard anything about... Gotham Knights. I mean, Gotham Knights is not part of the same series. But I certainly haven't heard of it being less quality. I'm not sure about Origins. I haven't heard much about that one one way or the other, honestly. Okay, um... Is there anywhere interesting we can... Oh, wait. Why do I still have level up? Sufficient perk points. Gain more components when disassembling. Junk items are automatically disassembled. Allows you to craft rare items. Biz that won't make any major headlines favor straightforward tasks and chance encounters. Danger very high. I don't want to do that one anyway. Paid in full. Pay off your debt to Victor. 21k. Let's do this one. City reskin with a different storyline than is like did they literally reuse the entire city as it appeared in Arkham City? After dealing with DeFreeze, Origins gives you a blue grenade with the same function. Oh! Hey! Hey, you! I gotta get to a Ripper, man! Oh I... my god, this guy. Oh! I'll pay you! Okay. Alright. Great! Why are we standing here? <laughs> to the car! Now! I remember this guy. This is a hilarious mission. Let me guess, Mr. Stud XCV-19 series. Yeah, how'd you know? I know my implants, including the black market stuff. Faulty <laughs> series, got recalled. Still selling it on the street, though. Hey, <laughs> listen, 
Thanks for not laughing at me. Appreciate it. It ain't easy, I'll tell you that. Fuck you! <laughs> just our luck. Ah! Go, just go, mow him down! Chill, Jum. Be gone in a <laughs> sec. Chill? You tell me to chill! It burns! Fuck, it burns! Chill. I'm doing what I can. What I said to my output. She didn't <laughs> like that too much. Oh my god. Back. <laughs> oh, st uh, stand still. You better go around. Jesus fucking Christ! You really gotta keep yelling like that. You even know how much it hurts? Like I'm screwing a goddamn pencil sharpener! Well, suffer in silence, Chum. Heard what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Real fucking funny. I thought so. But you know, wild screaming at Torin Taz isn't headline news. Could be just some screamo band set rehearsal that or something a shade more sinister. I don't need to remind you this is the Maelstrom Hotspot. If you confirm a cyber psycho's behind this, please do try to keep them alive. Thanks. I can't! Oh, I can't! Okay, we're- Hey, you after! I'll call you! But- Ugh. <laughs> Burns! Flaming like crotch man. First will come the great reality check, which ushers in the future of the world. APB out for suspect accused of organized crime activity near Raw Street and Shipyard Way. Scavengers led by Yelena Sidorova, presumed to be armed and dangerous, have assaulted multiple homeless persons. Night City officials are offering a reward for neutralizing the threat. I can't! <laughs> this is probably a good place to save. Wait, did it actually already just save? What the heck? Okay. Yeah, okay, so it auto-saved. Busy while waiting for a call from the distressed man. Now, where was the cyber psycho guy? Side job. Where the bodies hit the floor, danger high, find the cyber psycho. There are a few certainties in Night City. Super sketch stomach-melting street food, politicians choked by corporate leashes, and the echo of screams heard coming from the Torrentaz club. Oh wait, and one more. If you step foot down the wrong alley, your head will probably roll out the other end. Okay, I remember that one. I came to this part of the city a lot later last time. So I think we should probably steer clear this time for a little while, because this is like I literally just started. Fast travel destinations. You can go to a fast travel location by placing your cursor on it and pressing X. Ah, so afterlife is way down there, okay.
Yeah, I played this when it launched, Mickenstein. It was a bit rough back then. It was a bit rough. I was playing the PlayStation 4 version, which was considered to be the worst of the versions, but I was playing it on the PS5, which smoothed out a lot of the issues with it. So I had kind of a mixed experience where it really wasn't as bad as people were saying for me, but not a lot of people had PS5s at the time, so I can't really blame them for what they were saying either. And then also... Uh, and then also, I did have the occasional actual problem, like, the game was not entirely stable and it would usually crash on me at least once or twice every stream. So it's not like it was free of problems or anything like that. It was just kind of the worst of it was smoothed over, you know? Even the crashes weren't that big a deal, because the PS5 is fast enough that I was able to get back up and into the game again pretty fast whenever it happened. I'll play it when it shows up in the PS Plus subscription thingy. That's not a bad way to go. I wouldn't be surprised if that were to happen reasonably soonish. Netrunner Neotac Pants Legendary Skill Shard Breach Protocol Ram Jolt Just started Death Stranding and Jedi Fallen Order, two of my favorite games of recent years, Binkenstein. Death Stranding is so good. Okay, let's take a look. Oop, no, it's inventory. Oh, I can't actually wear that. I need uh, to be a higher level. Oh, same here. That's a shame. Oh, man. That, yeah. I need to be level 6. Reduces damage from explosion. Increases armor. Damn. Okay. I have to keep hold of that. That's a nice find, though. Legendary gear this early. Very cool. across the way there, right?
Lifestyle area. Yeah, this has got to be where I'm remembering. Okay, so let's see. We need 55 and then E9. The fuck are you sending me? Rat poison? Bleach? Got three clients in the ER, another one already flatlined. Clients are starting to get spooked. Thought we had a deal. Thought I could trust you. We're done. Need someone to watch your back. Danger prowls night said E. Animals got you covered. everybody. This is supposed to be a hostile area. Blocked. Oh, there's the camera. It has a pretty limited view, though. minute warning, folks. What? Space Vikings, thank you so heckin' much for 19 months, sir. How are you tonight? What's going on? Just got home. How's your evening going? Well, I'm getting back into cyberpunk, so I can't really complain. It is pretty fun, as I expected. And it seems to be running a heck of a lot better than it did last time I tried playing it. Burning Man quest.
that wasn't as spectacular as I was expecting. I thought things were gonna explode. I'm also a little creeped out that we're not getting any sign of actual opponents here. Chasing a kitten, getting it out of a car engine? Then losing it again? Oh no, Binkenstein, I'm so sorry to hear that. That doesn't sound like it was a whole lot of fun. C B D E nine Data Mine Three. box. Okay, so I can't do anything with that. Just gonna drop a lurk. Oh, shoot. God. We have uh, ads in progress. I will see you guys again in a very short time. Got about you. Get out of my face. My god, it's still only 48. There you go. And I'm back. Thank you so much for the lurk space. I appreciate it. I'll uh, see you again soon. Okay, can I? This is a terrible idea. Oh, Ooh. but uh, I wonder if I can take a bit of a shortcut here. Yes, I can. There's absolutely nothing going on in this one. Okay, what the... Where is everybody? This is a hostile area. There's supposed to be people to fight and do stuff to. just go into hiding during the day or something? I mean... I'm kind of okay with just looting the crap out of their area, but I am confused.
Microwave. I'm so confused. I thought I remembered combat in this area with quite a few people. Maybe there's a trigger event that I haven't actually activated yet. this orange structure over here. That's vaguely disappointing. Hey! It's, it's me! The guy who... You know. Uh, the guy with the smoking crotch? That's one way to put it. Anyway, just calling to say I transferred the funds. You doing okay? Well, they managed, uh, to save your, um, you know. Yeah, as much as they could. At least the pain is gone. Anyway, once it heals, I'll get a better model. Something top shelf. Mm -hmm. Just uh, check the warranty next time. <laughs> Will do. Take care, man. Excellent. Burning desire. What's this? Nazare Racer. Number one viewer's favorite on the show. Guns and horses for two years in a row. I did. Yes, indeed, I did. Okay.
Oh, wait, is this... No, I can't do it. Okay. Oh! Ugh. Whoops! Not what I had in mind. I'm sorry to hear that, Shark. I hope you feel better quick. I do appreciate the lurk, though. Sometimes really, really good stuff. There are places in the game once the world opens up a bit and we can go anywhere in the city and out and around it, where you can find really good legendary gear just lying out in the open. I mean, I mean, technically we just found one, I guess. I'm too low level to use it, but we can still keep hold of it until I can use it. Feel free to go to your uh, whatever you're doing, rest, relax, not respond, but I hope you've had a good week. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a preem BD? Sure. In I go. Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. 
Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. All right. Have fun, input. Welcome My to Lizzie's. What a sweet little face you have. No? Okay. Sit at the bar and ask about Evelyn. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? Big tipper. Generous when I get the answers I'm looking for. Appreciate the gesture, truly. But afraid I don't get paid to talk. Opposite, actually. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. We're going street kid this time, Matai. How are you doing? It's good to see you. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello sooner? I wanted to get a good look at you first. And? Like what you see? If I didn't, rest assured. You'd know. Come on. Know a place we can talk where ears won't prick up to listen. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. If anyone asks, we're not here. Just got home from work. Nice to catch you for a few to rest before bed. Excellent. It's nice what to have you here. Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Don't know him well, haven't worked together long. No idea if Dex exaggerates. A little, a lot. You got me. Just started working with him, in fact. I've heard there are two kinds of fixers. Those with stable crews on long contracts and short leashes. Loyalty and predictability they value above all else. Then there's the other kind. Dex's kind. The other kind? Come on. Can't leave that hanging. Headhunters. They lay their trust elsewhere. Not in people, but in a thing. Their intuition. They bet on potential. And if they lose that bet, it's the last mistake they ever make. I'm hoping Dex's intuition has served him well in this case. Let's cut to the chase. What do you got for me? Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka. Making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Classy Corp hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Hmm. Well, the decor's to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? He's in town? Don't you read the scream sheets? The media couldn't get enough of Yori coming to Night City. It was all over the headlines. Anyway, he's heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son. What, so Arasaka Jr.'s planning to grab the reins while in Night City? 
Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Telling me you're one of them? Seriously, he's my target? So we're not jumping the corp. We're jumping Yorinobu Arasaka himself. <sighs> Yorinobu is a puppet. He lost all his cards years ago when he failed to do daddy's bidding. Saburo's had Yuri's balls in a vice for years. He might just turn the screw and crush them outright if he learns his son's up to no good again. Top dog like Yorinobu's bound to have an army on call. Hotel's probably a goddamn fortress by now, too. Yorinobu keeps exactly no hustle around. Not one guard. Got rid of them a long time ago. Huh. Why is that? Surely you know what they say about Arasaka Into. Sneeze in Night City, and a blossom drops from a cherry tree in Tokyo. Yorinobu was convinced his Arasaka security detail reported directly to his father. Hmm. Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Wait, Neutral Netwatch is mixed up in this. Netwatch provides net security for all corporations, and collects eddies in the millions for it. But in this day and age, everyone's in the game, and no one can afford to be a saint. To win, one has to go all in. Okay, so where does he keep it? Fine, so no Arasaka security on the device because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. It can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing details, human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite, the glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up, mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm, BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. Okay. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy will help. She's a mox, too. Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. We shall see. <clears throat> hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. Gonna make me barf. Mm -hmm. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BD. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw. But yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. 
V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. You should see the jig jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? I think I can take it. Think I can handle it. Let's just do this. Righto. Sit down, settle in, and we'll get you going. Create your sensory profile first. Okay. A what profile? A what profile now? A model of your perceptions and emotional responses. You need to adjust that so the raw BD won't overwhelm you. If I don't, best case scenario, you'll get nauseous as soon as you're in. Probably barf like you would in a shoddy virtue environment. Mm-hmm. And worst case? Your synapses sizzle like locusts in a deep fryer. Yum. But we're not about to let that happen. Nah. Okay, profile away. Okay, hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. You need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. Can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see. Where could we? <sighs> Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks. Sides won't take a sec. Got something here. Should be perfect. Okay, let's do it. Boot it up. Mm hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first, let you get your bearings, then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in in three, two, one. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Down, everybody, on the ground. Want to see you kissing the flooring, muddy? Now, or I will fucking drop you. I swear to God. Whoa, yeah, hey, uh, uh, now. Before I blow your fucking head off! I like the mini Rubik's Cube. Two by two. Ah! Two by two Slow, by two, deep I guess. Breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That was too much. That was too much. Felt the. I feel the guy's pain, his stress, his hope. Hope wrapped up in something else. Mm-hmm. Probably took a booster just before. You'll be fine. Got everything set up. Let's switch over to editing mode. And we go again. 
I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control and analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console to unpause. Try it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Okay. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. Can I, can I? All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing off the creative. You go in, yeah. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Sorry guys, I get, I'm getting sucked in. I just realized we have ads on the go again, so I'm going to go to uh, just a quick break here, and I'll be back in a minute. 25% of it units destroyed, so that means there's only four. Whatever is launching those LRMs is the last. Heads up, Commander. You've got hostile contacts inbound. I should have kept my mouth shut. Katarn. What? Hey, it's Cal Katarn. That's amazing. Hey, it's Cal Katarn. Hey, it's Cal Katarn. Hey, it's Cal Katarn. <laughs> oh my god, that was amazing. See, I'm not the only one. The NCPD does it. Okay. We'll leave it after a cyberpunk clip. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his butt at the beginning. Now scan it. Oh. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on. Where's the gun? You go. Okay, right here. Uh, bold sections on the track indicate a scannable clue. The clue will be highlighted for the duration of the sequence if the editor is set to the correct layer. Clues may overlap each other. The spot where they overlap on the recording track will be especially bright. After being successfully scanned, clues disappear from the track. Excellent. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, R1. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay. Fuck! On you ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously. Like what's happening right next to me. 
Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw, stuff the rollers cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared, meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hello, nice. Now, let's wait till the guy punches out the gong at the counter. Okay. Fast forward to where the customer is hit. Buddy! On the ground! What I see you kissing the flooring! Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. Oh, that would be her. Uh, oh, switch layer. Okay. All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. I want to go Get back off. first. Though. Get off and this is That's like the limits of the reality recorded by the BD roller. The editor won't let you outside it. Makes sense? Moving signal range, okay, fair enough. Yes, it's the guy like us. Go restock. I'll take the register. And a of How about you suck a bag of dicks? Okay. We have a deal today on two flavors. Cody and now, surf and everybody! Fast forward to where the robber is shot. On the ground! What I see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yep, I think that'll be good. Yeah. Impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? Dunno, I... Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... Oh, yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, 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 who? Running for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Evelyn, I won't get a damn thing out of this without T-Bug. Judy, please. Ev, he wants to bring a runner in? What part of that don't you understand? How do I know she'll only perch in this footage? Observe, not fuck with anything. Me. I'm your guarantee. Yeah, right. Help me. This one last time. I promise everything will work out. Just like we planned. Okay, V. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey, V. What's happening? 
Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Judy and Evelyn, they're chill. They're helping me work through this BD. Uh-huh. All right. You gonna tell me what this is about? Listen, need your help. Got no clue what to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request now. Got it. You ready? A millisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick temp ice and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. Okay. I don't remember it taking this long. Okay, Heartbeat. we're in. Eyes open. Got to find out where your Nobu's keeping the relic. Extreme. Extreme caution advised. You look like a cut of fuckable meat, are you? Shit, camera's packed with new tech. Motion sensors, heat sig activators, IFF. You skilled enough to kill it all? Mucho more than enough. Just need access to their subnet. Okay. That's nothing significant. I said no. They'll have my head. Another motion sensitive camera. You shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. We shall see soon enough. My father's a tired, visualist old gray beard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. We'll listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality, stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Noted. In a hmm, hung up. Go back to when they first start talking. Need to hear the whole thing. We just heard the whole thing. Get on. They'll have my head for this. Then you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. We shall see soon enough.
My father is a tough. Does he love him? Oh, that's the problem. I was on the wrong layer. Okay, hang on, hang on. I need to check out that bit up there. You look like a cut of fuck No, I don't see what it is. Scan Yorinobo's phone as he talks. Okay. Meet, are you? I know. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But Make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. Here in a drone. Ventilation and cooling? Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visionless old graybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever in his tiny frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must not provide right. them. In a Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Okay, let's see. Can we go back here? No. Alarm firmware's fresh, but saw excited birds chirping on a BBS. Something about lots of seeds falling to this sieve. Let me generate keys. I can forge their six. Okay, so that was the thing that I was looking for. He's taken a particular interest in this project. My father's a Candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. That's again. Hold it. Yes, I love you. Hang on, we gotta scan these. 
Automated turret. Automated turrets. Latest scanner model. Systems all connected to the server. Can you shut them off? Externally, no way. Gotta get in, check out how they link into the system first. Mm-hmm. Looks like all their security systems are linked to the hotel subnet. We need the flathead. No other way to shut down these systems. Can't get around them ourselves? Nope. At least I'm fresh out of ideas. Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah, oh, you'll like this. Okay, what do we have here? Liberty. Loaded. Safety's on. Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. Tablet? No. Now the tablet. Manual details a special tip-controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Okay. Just a sec. Signal range. There's nothing really here. Conditioning, standard model for hotels of this caliber. Tip matches that stipulated in the docks, but no way the chip's hiding there. Too risky. Tip fluctuations, risk of damage. Well, let's scrub backwards. See what we can find. Geez. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tint's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. More this way? Oh, hang on. What's over this way? Just a fancy ass fridge. Tip doesn't match the guidelines. Won't find a thing here. Here? No. I really don't remember where the heck the thing is. Let's keep going back. 
The heat sig matches the spec in the docks. You already know who's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm-hmm. We got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Okay. Exit the brain dance when you're ready. I think that's about it. Get everything you need. <sighs> yep. That'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling VDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Thanks, Judy. We needed that recording, Judy. The BD practically does our job for us. The BD will be the death of us. Seriously. If Arasaka finds out you have it, you're dead. I'm dead. Judy, relax. Nobody will ever know. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, City will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. One sec. Wanted in Night City. 45 reward. Oh, social credit, 45. Bounty class 3. Illegal Wanted for illegal protest and resisting arrest. Abilities combat stim. Wow. Okay, so she's, uh, she's wanted. Thanks, Judy. Really. Don't worry. I know what I'm doing. Let's walk. Well, what do you think? Intel on Yorinobu, the chip, the BD from Kompeki. Winds are right. Plan's perfect. Job like this comes one in a million. Hmm. Thanks. Now the punchline, please. Just sounds too good to be true. What's the catch? Cold feet. Are you looking to get out of it? I want to know if you're really in control here. You're not sending me into the sort of shit I can't wait out of. V, I have zero reasons to haze you. We're in this together. Really. Trust me that I got this. You're not worried? Arasaka will flag and screen anyone who's had dealings with Yorinobu. Oh, they'll have a long list then. Packed full of big names. Much bigger than mine. You tell me who they check first. Corpo hotshots and cutthroats? Or a little bedroom plaything like me? Okay, guys, it looks like we're about ready for my last break of the evening. My last proper break of the evening. So I'm going to go take that and... Um... getting low on charge and I'll be back in a few minutes so if you guys need to get up and grab some food or a drink or a snack now's a real good time to do it and I'll meet you back here in just a bit I expect you to faithfully carry out my request to teach a lesson to the thief Una you need not kill her but I have no qualms about it if you deem it necessary hold up hold up
I feel so betrayed. That was my cheese, Hulda. <laughs> oh. Uh. Um. <laughs> you gain XP for cleaning things up. That's actually. Oh crap! <laughs> oh, thought for a moment I was going right into. I have a bad feeling about this. Oh, oh boy! Oh, sorry, guard. I hope they're not hostile now. Ah, uh, crap. Whoops. You have traveled a long way only to die care by carelessly stepping to your death. What a clod. That's made of wood. It should float. I can't reach that from here. 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 Well, crap. How about a swordfish? I guess I'll be needing a sword. This one will do. So you can just pick up the anchor well, and walk that away. Wasn't so hard. Ah. Whew. Seven misses. More misses than anyone else. But fewer bats. Yes. <laughs> Journal entry added. Experience points received two hundred. I'm going to put a bit of a rush on this, which means we might not actually get to... Uh, wow. That's okay. That is a rite of passage every Valheim player must go through. Would you please stand still while I murder you? Gotcha. Damn it, another one. Another one bites the dust. That works. Auto drive. We're going to be taking our first look. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's amazing. Oh, oh no! It's fine. That was very discreet. 
Master of Stealth. Right. Now just a bit more. Mm. All right. I'm back. Sorry about that, folks. Whoops. I think I see how you know so much about Yorinobu. It's simple. Men like Pillow talk a bit too much. So it's just about the sex? Biz. And biz only. You sure Yorinobu doesn't expect this kind of move from you? <laughs> He's got no idea. Trust me. He's too busy with Netwatch to give me that kind of attention. Besides, even if some suspicion takes root in his mind, it shouldn't matter. He won't react in time. And that's something you'll handle, right? Sorry, just untangling my uh, power cord here. There we go. So, what now? V, do this job for me. I mean, me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. You want to haze our fixer? You want to fuck over our fixer? I knew something was up. Dex is a middleman. And a useless one at this point. Evelyn, you don't mess with fixers. That's the one rule every merc in this city knows. And actually follows. But if we're smart... Doesn't matter. A mistake like that will cost you a rep. And without a rep, you're nobody. You sure you want to do this? Better ask yourself that question. Do you want to spend the rest of your days blasting scabs? Or become a legend overnight? Your choice. If I agree, there'll be hell to pay for sure. I know. Whatever you decide. It stays between us. I can offer 50%. Eddie's enough to do whatever the hell you like. I'll be finished. Dex won't forgive a dirt move like this. Dex isn't the only fixer in town. But my offer's the only one you'll ever get. <sighs> Let me think about it. Mm-hmm. Knowing what we know call, about Dex... I'll send you my number. Okay. It makes this Good choice luck. a lot easier, honestly. Now go. I need a few words with Judy. Okay then. How are things looking, Mr. V? Hey, Red Fox. How's it going? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. Beautiful. T Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. And the flathead. Nothing yet. On it now. T Bug says no chance of that ship without that buy. To work then, Mr. V. I'm glad to hear it, Red Fox. I hope you've had a good week so far. It's been a little bit. I hope everything is good. Oh, lovey, how's it going? What's the status? Met with the client, played me a BD of the place. We're supposed to visit. BD, huh? All right, all right, just keep me posted. A bit cold in the UK? Yeah, it's pretty cold here too. Everything's kind of frozen what a up. Sweet little face you have. No, no wonder everything looks very different. It's okay. Call Miltech Agent Meredith Stout optional. you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. There a problem? Nuh uh, not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal? Fine. 
First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm channel under the overpass. Meet you there. Okay, the pickup. Where did I park? Where did I park? Oh, there I am. I had forgotten that driving in this game is a bit of an adventure in and of itself. Excuse me. Just make sure I save. Look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Conditions? Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down. I just want to talk. Christ, Meredith. Shut your trap. That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly, forthrightly. Are you here alone? <laughs> yep. Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. Now listen, folks. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen. I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <laughs> him you can let go. Wanna hear what he has to say? I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. 
so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. I'm in. Encrypted shard. Some shards you'll find in the world will contain information hidden behind data encryption measures. To decrypt a shard, first either open it through the notification when you acquire it, or find it later in the shards tab under journal in the main menu. Then select crack security to unlock its secrets. You pay with that chip, and that's all you gotta worry about. Try to fuck me in any way, and I'll be seeing you real soon. Okay then. You're doing business you with it. You're making a mistake! This is already good dead! But she'll take you down with her! Okay then. This does run so much better than it used to. This is really good. Alright, so I don't think we can use this to get out to any other part of the city, can we? Also, it looks like I've got level up stuff again, so let's take a look, maybe a quick look here. I was kind of interested in grabbing this mechanic ability. More components when disassembling sounds nice. And I have an attribute perk available. I think I'm maxed out on cool. No, I'm not. I can actually go higher. But... I'm thinking we go reflexes. You slayed a shadow dragon! Congratulations, Greeny. That's amazing. You know what? So, I take it uh, Baldur's Gate is going well, then? i try going through here some. I don't think it's going to let me go very far. Ah. Yeah, that would be a problem. So how, uh, how far into the game are you at this point? I mean, you've got to be getting pretty decent if you've uh, taken out a Shadow Dragon. Two damn side quests. Yeah, that's true. That, that's a good point. Having a bit of a blast in this game. It hasn't been nearly as much gunplay as I had expected. I kind of forgot that they give you a bit of a lengthy journey to open everything up when you play this. Gold, damn. Okay, what are we going to do? Um... Cyber Psycho sighting, I don't think we want to do that. High danger. Paid in full. I don't have that kind of cash, unfortunately. Oh, the ping quick hack. Okay, let's do that.
So I take it you're trying to accomplish pretty much everything that it's possible to accomplish in the game. Uh, T-Buck sent me. Said you'd have something for me. You're V, right? She had me hold the demon for you. It should work on any third-gen deck. Always glad to grab a hack. Got a Militech Paraline. Got a Militech Paraline. I think it'll do. Solid gear. For a beginner. Okay. Glad to grab a demon, always. You could test it now. I have an access point. If you'd like, that is. You might extract some shim soft or subroutines. Seems worth a try, either way. Alrighty, let's see what we got here. I do have a little money. Jams the target's weapon, rendering it temporarily unusable. Sonic Shock deafens the target. Short Circuit. I think I've got that one. Request Backup. Reboot Optics. Pretty sure I've got that. Ping. There we go. Overheat. Applies burn to the target, dealing high damage over time. Less effective against drones, mechs, and robots. Grab that, the ping one. Disables target cyberware abilities, can disable movement or resistances, very effective against fast moving targets and net runners. Okay, I'm gonna take that. Oh, contagion is super fun too. Okay, we're grabbing those. Got anything Nova for sale? If you can afford it, yes. I uh, don't know that I can really afford it. Uh, it's gonna have to do. How's this work? Any punk off the street can waltz in here, grab some shady running soft? No. Not just any punk. Over the counter, we fix cyber decks. But if you come recommended and you know what you are looking for, I'm sure you will find it. Sounds reasonable. Okay, let's see. Nope, I want inventory. Oh, actually, that's weird. My hair looks green, which is cool, but I thought it was blue, so that's odd. Select the cyber deck slot in your inventory. Oh, okay, cyber deck. Where is cyber deck? There. 
To install a quick hack on your cyberdeck, you need to first select it from the list, select the ping quick hack. It should then appear in a cyberdeck slot on the left side of your screen. Okay. So, reboot optics and ping. Let's do... Civilian Yokotsuru Distract enemies. <laughs> I thought I it was done. I'm not done. Never mind. Upload ping to the camera to find the access point. your personal link to connect to the access point and hack it. Okay, so we need 1C, then 55. All daemons uploaded. Freaking level up perk points. Bullet jock. Allows RAM to recover during combat. Recover four RAM units every seconds every sixty seconds. They've changed a lot of stuff in this. Health slowly regenerates, okay. Always gotta have that. Okay, what are we going to do next? I I would kind of prefer to get through the story and just unlock the whole map for us. But at the same time... Who knows what you might find. Okay, we're going to try that. At the same time... I have this terrible feeling like we have to go through that whole thing with the... 
gearhead guys, the really heavily modded guys. That's going to be kind of mildly terrifying if we go in before we're ready. That'll buff out, that's fine. Not a problem. Sorry, folks. I just realized ads are in progress. We'll be back in a moment. I'll skin you and make a purse for my wife. <laughs> I probably should have taken advantage of that. But that was too funny. Just a quick one that time because I was so late in recognizing that the um, that the ants were already gone. That's all right. No, I'm the best at navigation. Ever since Vic installed my Kuroshi eyes, I've had this feeling that someone was watching. Cybernetics are our undoing, a blessing and a curse. We replace our flesh most sacred with metal, their metal. They hold the off switch, our sight, our breath, even our minds, theirs for the taking. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! <laughs> in their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed masses by putting our laughter, our tears, on full display! Ah, oh my god! Look, a guy. Like in that show! Rick, get next to him! I'll snap wow, still okay. if you're arresting him for revealing Going government already about secrets. to hit the hay, but one of the cool things to mind alert. Uh, it's so good to have you here, then. I hope that I am providing that. I'm really glad to be playing this game again. It's been a while. Where the bodies hit the floor. Do we have another? Beat on the breath. Oh, the that's the Kabuki ring. I don't want to do that. Meet with Jackie. 
Okay, I remember a few of these. That's danger high. Late. Fucked in the hell. Why they had to make you feel? Like this is Max Nova. Psycho, what's the worst that could happen? Very low level, I'm sure it'll be fine. That'll buff out, that's not a problem. Now, is that one just off to the side not the one we're going to do? Oh, I guess it is. It's just, it looks closer than it actually is. Okay. Like I said, roads are more of a suggestion than a rule. Psycho attack, all confirmed, even reported to MaxTac. Thing is, nobody's gonna show, cause Miltech shut it right down. Psycho's gotta be one of theirs. My eddies are on Lieutenant Mower. Anyway, Corpo's gonna go straight to treatment, so make very, very sure you keep her in one piece. Good idea to save again here. We really haven't been tested very much in combat, so I'm not sure how my build is going to do. New shard orders. Target presents symptoms of cyberpsychosis, result of telephone consultation with physician. Negative treatment impossible. Target is located at the attached coordinates and waiting for paramedics to arrive. Surprise attack possible. Warning, target is armed with military-grade combat implants. Highest caution is advised. Upon neutralization of threat, send report via encrypted channels. Who would have thought? Okay, unfortunately, this means my current ping and contagion loadouts are maybe not the best. I'm thinking cyber malfunction is probably better. And maybe reboot optics. Got it! 
Oh, they've got music from the... Holy crap, they've got... Wow. I've never heard this version of the song before. Lunity did a cover of this, and it's absolutely stunning. They have music from the cyberpunk anime in the game now. That's so cool. I love it. Okay. Um, I just got new gear, didn't I? Or assault rifle? Maybe not, actually. I thought I just picked up a sniper rifle. Maybe it was sniper rifle ammo? Okay, so we need 55 E91C. Distract enemies. This is why we save. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to start watching the anime soon after this. Oof. Sniper rifle ammo. Um, well, well, well. Pipe explosive, antenna base explosive, can't help but notice it did not reveal her, that's a bit of a problem. E9, E9, 55.
this was probably a terrible idea. Anything to her. inventory. How do you switch your equipped weapon? I would love to go with any of this. I have two street cred and I'm fourth level. Oh god. One percent health. I am so toast. I really need a better deck. Oh. 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 Ah. Okay, I'm gonna try the katana if I can make that work. the katana. Oh, this should be happening! <laughs> I 
Come on. Let's stop pretending you'll make it out of here alive. Bounty warranted. Reward 10? Oh my god. Send the information to Regina. Okay. How'd you describe Watson in one sentence? The Japanese built Kabuki, but the Chinese live there mostly. North side used to be plated in chrome, now it's covered in rust. We have an entire aquarium full of corpos, and that's no metaphor. Know what all that comes out to? One sentence is never enough? That's Watson. Okay. See you around. Bye, V. Remember. The media lies. She looks like she's alive, at least. Uh, open messages. Lieutenant Mower. Sending you the data I got for the Miltech woman. She was in the core special unit. Clearly, she felt something was seriously wrong and put out a call for help. But instead of help, Militech sent in a hit squad. Prem, sending you a ride. I managed to extract some more data about her, but not much. You know how it is with Militech. Get too nosy and they start sending you death threats. Looks like Mower was chipped with experimental combat implants. Maybe there was some glitch in the code that made her snap? I'll look into it. Thanks again. Money's already on its way. I can't believe I survived. Assign a grenade to a, the combat gadget quick slot in your inventory so you can make easy use of it during combat. good news is I have made back all the money just from collecting crap that I spent on those subroutines. So that's pretty heckin' nice. The other good news is that that katana was freakishly effective and I think that might make it easier for me to consider doing more melee this run through than I normally typically would. Come on. Man, this place is a looter's paradise. There's so much stuff here. Is it after? Wow. Alright guys, I would love to keep going for a while and just keep playing this game, but um, 
It's after four o'clock. And that means I think we're gonna have to call it here. We got it the pickup. Excellent. Good. Street kid level four. Four hours, four minutes. That looks good. So how about we go and we find ourselves somebody to raid this evening? Let me get my list of awesome folks open. Okay, so... Let me see if there's anybody... Well, we've got Greeny, obviously. Always love raiding Greeny. We've got a few options. Adrios is playing Bendy in the Ink Machine. I want to see if anybody happens to be playing Cyberpunk. I'm not really seeing it. Lunity's on, playing Uncharted The Last Legacy. I've really been loving her uh, Uncharted playthroughs. T with Mandy is playing Deliver Us Mars. Burke Black is on playing Cyberpunk 2077, actually. But he's got 1.7k viewers. I don't know that he necessarily needs our raid. I think maybe we'll go and uh, pay a visit to Greeny this evening. But I do want to start raiding more new people. Not always just the same people that we always visit. We need to get new friends into our circle. But tonight, let's go with uh, the friend we've got. So we're going to raid Greeny Trini. And I will get you the raid call. Here at the Library of Lore, we use Library Raid. You've been bookmarked with the heart emote and the wave emote of the channel if you are a sub. If you're not a sub, you can use the Twitch Raid and the Tomb Raid emote. In either case, sub or non-sub, please feel free to use any emote you feel is fun and appropriate for a raid. If you have emotes of your own or maybe emotes from another streamer or from Twitch themselves, feel free to copy the raid message, arrange the emotes you want to use the way you want them to appear. It'll all be good in my book. So I'm going to get my own raid message copied and ready to go right here. Thank you all so much for hanging out this evening. It's been a really fun stream. We're going to definitely do some more Cyberpunk. Probably won't be a main game that we blast through all in one thing, but uh, I'll try to work it into the schedule every now and then. So uh, we'll uh, get going with that playthrough. Uh, in the meantime, let's get over to Greedy's channel. I will be back tomorrow night. Let me just check my schedule and see what we're going to be playing tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow, I was thinking... It might be fun. It's been a little bit since we did any Skyrim. We might do some more Skyrim, and that means we'll probably end up doing some more crowd control as well, so that'll be a lot of fun. So let's get over to Greeny's channel. I'll meet you over there, so have yourselves a wonderful rest of your night, day, evening, whatever it is where you are in the world, and I'll catch you again real soon. Bye for now. So good. Oh, I love this. OK, 
Okay, I guess these guys are immortal. Nope. Nope. 